Hi everyone, I want to show you a build that is rather new or rather only playable in season 22. It has existed before but it's not really a thing. And this is the combo between Inner 6 piece and Uliana 4 piece. So this build is based around 7 sided strike only. It doesn't have exploding palm in this. It's not like Uliana, you know, where you just use a 7 sided strike as an activator. No, here it actually deals the damage. So the way this works is you have the 4 piece bonus from Uliana, 777% of the total damage done on each hit. You have 14 hits because you have the Lion's Claw in the cube. And uh, well, that stacks up quite neatly. And then you have the big multiplier coming from the inner set here. So this is how the, the basic setup works. And well, we use the Fulminating Onslaught rune, which is an AoE rune for 7 sided strike. Has a bit of longer cooldown than what you're used to from Uliana, but this uh, makes it so that it can actually blast uh, AoE quite nicely. And a single target is not terrible either. So I tried to build out recently, and uh, this was before the recent buff to the Uliana 4 piece, giving you a 44, uh, no, sorry, 77% damage reduction. So the, I was quite squishy because of the missing damage reduction of the Uliana set and you don't really have a lot of options to include other stuff here. So we have the Mantras from the inner and we have the Spirit Guards and that's about it because you simply need all the other slots here with um, better items or like strong items or the set items. And well, now you're going to be super tanky. So I was playing this at Paragon 1k, I had like 8000 dexterity or so when I tried it for the first time, so my typical 1k um, level 25 gem setup and uh, I was I was struggling a bit but it worked and then I put in like a few hundred more paragons I had like 1400 and or so I think like 12k dex and well I was totally fine I was doing like 110 I believe and uh, it was uh, much easier then and now we gonna have almost uh, four, uh, over four times the toughness because of this buff to Uniana's. So you can probably take even like some more offensive options now and this build can be optimized. I believe that for uh, high-end pushing this is gonna go at least to 130 or even higher like 135 but it's only really a thing during season 22 because you get the flow of eternity here and flow of eternity not only gives you double the damage but it also gives you pretty much double the, the casts and while you do most of the damage during the convention cycle you cannot spawn Oculus Rings if you don't have Flow of Eternity. And Oculus Ring is also almost two times the damage. So this is basically where it comes from and without Flow of Eternity I would say this build is probably something like 8 to 10 tiers weaker. So it's in Unknown Season it's gonna be like 125 or so maybe. But yeah, this is the setup here. Uh, so you just understand, understand a bit of what I'm doing there. It's actually rather fun to play. So you have basically everything you want with Dash, you have Cyclone Strike, you have some tankiness now as well of the Uliana buff, which, uh, as I said, is not in this video yet. This was pre-buff. So uh, if you see me struggling with survival, it's not gonna be an issue at all anymore. And uh, well, actually there might be some optimizations now. So I might revisit this and actually make a guide for this. But for now, I just wanna show you this run here and uh, give you like an impression of the build. So I hope you enjoyed this. See you guys next time. Ah! <laughs> Oof. But the, uh, the top is much better now, so that's good. Even just 10k decks. I didn't actually get a. Uh, oh, close, yeah, feels bad. Oh, 
slash ins. Let's be careful here. And you have to build a bit more tanky, I guess it'll be very fun. Oh, can I finish them? Almost. This guy getting taunted by my tank I'm surprised how much thank you I am than last time. It was just, uh, I don't know, 300 more paragons used or so. 400. It's nuts. This guy's a jug. It's not really impressive here. Physical and in the middle of the cold, I remember the cycle.
Motor klar. Water. <laughs> My head's really ready. Yeah. It can't be aim your damage. Like I targeted the yellow and my 7 side strike just goes everywhere, but not on this guy. So. I think I have too little cooldown actually. I should have probably gone for a better cooldown roll somewhere because I'm falling behind here yeah, for my timings. Does Cyclone Stack actually consume a Mythic Rhythm? It should, right? Oh boy. Yeah. It's Plague Tunnel, so we're never gonna get a pile in here. Feels good, man. We have one pile so far. Here's a room actually, let's go. Shields. It's too early. Not too late. Okay. No, we can. Okay. Ha! <laughs> okay, spawned under me. How nice is that? I think it's not that terrible, and since it's also not really a crazy high tier here. 
Okay, here we go. Oh. Oh, she walks away. And that actually cancels it. Are you serious? Oh, that was actually much easier. Oh, there's a problem too. I'm <laughs> wishing out. So this is an uh, inner six-piece Uliana four-piece build based around seven-sided strike. And it's pretty much only really possible in the season. And this gets a really big boost. It's like a I don't know, eight-tier boost or more. It's quite fun.